drop test for chloride featuring Taylor's K1598. Who should use this kit? Taylor's K1598 contains a simple drop test to quickly and accurately determine chloride levels. Chlorides are salts that are produced when the gas chlorine is combined with a metal. Potassium chloride, calcium chloride, and sodium chloride, table salt, are examples of chloride salts. Although chlorides are usually not harmful to people, the sodium in table salt has been linked to heart and kidney disease. Chloride can enter surface water in many ways, through agricultural runoff, wastewater from industries, and from road salting, to name a few. Chloride is also prevalent in seawater, which is used by many industries to fulfill their cooling water needs. All cooling waters have a recommended maximum chloride level. If concentrations become too high, corrosion of metal pipes and related equipment may occur, resulting in shutdowns for repairs or costly equipment replacement. Chloride is mainly tested to control blowdown in boilers and bleed off in cooling systems. Determining chloride levels is also helpful in characterizing boiler feed water and detecting leaks in boiler system condensers. Chlorides are determined with a drop test using either the argentometric method or the mercuric nitrate method. Taylor manufactures both types of test kits. Taylor's K1598, which we will be demonstrating in this video, employs the mercuric nitrate method. This method is preferred over the argentometric method since the distinct color change signaling the endpoint is easier to recognize. The K1598 comes complete with all the reagents and equipment necessary for performing a drop test to determine chloride levels. Sulfide, bromide, orthophosphate, over 30 parts per million, and iodide all titrate as chloride, causing a positive interference. To prevent this from occurring, test for the suspected interfering agent, dilute the sample with DI water as necessary, and then retest. Before beginning this or any other Taylor test, it is best to read the instructions through to the end. Familiarizing yourself with all the steps to come is particularly important if the test is new to you or if the kit is newly purchased as sometimes our procedures change. First, decide which drop equivalents to use. If you suspect the chloride level is high, fill the 3 ml pipette, part number 4078, to the 2.5 ml mark with the sample water to be tested and add it to the 25 ml sample tube, part number 91980. Dispense another 2.5 ml of the sample to obtain 5 ml for testing. For low chloride levels, rinse and fill the number 91980 sample tube to the 25 ml mark with the water to be tested. Taylor sample sizer shown here is a great tool for getting accurate measurements every time. Holding the bottle vertically, add 10 drops of reagent 682 chloride reagent to the sample tube. Swirl to mix. For this demonstration, we are using Taylor's Speedster, which is sold separately but you can also manually swirl the sample. If the sample turns blue-purple, this is an indication that the pH is too high. To bring the pH into the proper range for testing, add reagent 686O sulfuric acid 1 normal dropwise, swirling after each drop until the color changes from blue-purple to yellow. Note. If the sample turns yellow after adding the chloride reagent, the pH is already in the correct range for testing. There is no need to add the sulfuric acid. Next, add reagent 845, 
mercuric nitrate titrating solution, dropwise, swirling and counting after each drop until the color changes from yellow to purple. Multiply the number of drops of mercuric nitrate titrating solution used by 10 and record as parts per million chloride. In this example, we use 20 drops, indicating a 200 parts per million concentration of chloride. In addition to the K1598, Taylor makes several other kits for testing chloride. Combination boiler and cooling water kits that include a test for chloride are also available. Taylor's knowledgeable customer service representatives are available to provide technical assistance about our products. Call 800-TEST-KIT.